Hi guys, Chris here from Heat the Ball Gaming and welcome back to episode 158 of that Football Manager 2019 save where we're the manager of Tasmania Berlin. It used to be Bundesliga to Berlinliga to Bundesliga, now it's just we're just the manager of Tasmania Berlin, Bundesliga perennials. And we are in sensational form. We've got the Europa League a semi final quarter to say quarter final, we've got the semi final today against RB Leipzig. And RB Leipzig are a pretty good team, but we're languishing down in 11th place. We are sitting in 5th, well, I think we're in 6th place now. So, we're still in the European qualifications. We've got a difficult run in, but we can do it, you know. So, in terms of the matches when you were last year, I'm, I'm just super excited. I just want to go straight for it. I get the double header against Real San Sebastian. I've got a confession to make. I didn't save the game straight afterwards and then I was trying to fiddle up because I've got like a sound problem and I've got a cupboard right here where I put a computer in there but I haven't got around to doing it yet. I've got a sound problem just to, um sounds like a turbo jet taken off and I have to try and edit it to suppress it but it's still happening even though you can still hear it even though I, I denoise it and try and keep the noise down. So yeah, I was down there fiddling about with it, didn't save it, lost it. So I had to play the game, replay the game three times to get a win. Because <laughs> every time I replayed it, Real Sociedad beat us. So I didn't want to come back and go, oh, by the way, we didn't win it. So, <laughs> and we, we drew RB Leipzig. I'm almost convinced the, the draws are already predetermined. In football manager, um, so there's no way of getting a better draw. If I'd got Celtic, I'd have kept it, <laughs> but I didn't get Celtic. So we followed it up against Hertha Berlin, who are the league leaders at the moment. They beat us 2 1. Frank Lejeune get taken the lead, and then Emmy Canu get a last minute equal uh, winner, which really annoyed me, but these things happen. And then we followed it up, we went to the German Cup semi-final and we won 2-0 we just don't lose in cup competitions you know what I mean and I I was trying to think the last time we, we lost in a cup competition you know what I mean and it's uh, it would have been when we were in the Bundesliga 2 so and it would have been German Pokal yeah we've always been a cup competition way back when we were in the 5th division and we and we beat uh, Eintracht Frankfurt in the first round of the German Pokal, right? you know what I mean? We've, we've always been a cup com uh, competition, but it basically gave us the Berlin Pokal. And then we followed that up with a 3 2 win over uh, Osberg. It was closer than it looks, to be honest. They went 2 2, and then Simic. Simic was just in sensational form, and of course, he's out just now. Leipzig haven't had as much rest as us. I think we we played the Saturday, they played the Sunday. So we're just going to keep it in this ultra-defensive tactic. Yeah, we may as well. It's working. So we're going for Shrek and Goals, Boy, Wood and Hibberick, who's starting to look like a player. And then Middendorp, Eugene. And then we've got Bompart, Lawrence and Slotner. And then up front, Music. And the big news is Yakin Yames, a young player that I signed last season, I'm sure it was last season, yeah, from Turkenspor, who's the 6th division of German football, he's making his debut today in the Europa League semi-final, what a debut for a young lad, I can't, yeah, he's about to be pinching himself here, he just came in my office thinking what's going on, I'm playing with under 19s, look mate, you want to play up front, Simic's injured, yes boss, so this is a big moment. He's got music to um, keep him company, so what number are we going to give him? There's not many numbers left. 29, right, there we go. He's got a 9 in it. It's a striker's number. So this is exciting. Hartby Leipzig, we, we've beat him a couple of times in the past, so they're not the, the dominant force in German football. I've seen in some saves where they've became the the best team in Germany. Um, right, nothing to lose. Have faith. Have faith and I have faith. Here we go. 
and tunnel interview. I'm not really wanting to let's send assistant to that. Oh, heater can go to that one. I was checking the, the assistant managers have passed. Muzzer, he's doing a fairly good job with Victoria 1889. He's turned into a proper good manager as well. Chipper, Yasin, Yasin. Oh, we're not. There was a kick off highlight as commentator on Saho, Clipper, and oh, Shrek dives. You know, for all, oh, but I keep saying Shrek's not a bad goalkeeper. He's. Does it impress me? You know what I mean? Every time I see him, you know, if we are to have out for next season, Kodar will probably be the number one and Shrek will be the experienced number two. And I'll have to scramble about and get a number three. So, oh, we make, let's make changes. Oh, and Conte has gave RB Leipzig, not Red Bull, RB Leipzig the lead. Simple header, shouldn't be losing that, especially with boys on that side. He's a dominant centre half. I'd expect it from Huberic, who's the junior centre half in this lineup. Right, here we go Middendorp to Bompart to Music. There's Slotner over the top of Jean. Oof! Music, Adi <laughs> Yamez on his debut. Yamez, the young Turk, signed from the Berlin Sixth Division, scores on his debut. Wow, really unselfish for Music. I've seen strikers try and shoot from there before, so the young lad. What oh, types are like? Where have we got this guy from? <laughs> I tried to play him a few times, but he um, he was always tied with under 19, so. Walter, come on. Oh, lovely. Slotner, the bomb part, who's the next Michelle Platini. And Yamas! Oh, unlucky from a young Turk. Back to Eugene. Clip it in. That's yours. Oh, right. And the highlight. Yeah, the next Michelle Platini. The rest of the guys are all the next ones, apart from Kodar, who's the next Peter Czech. For all the rest of them have got that tagger. Yeah, I don't know any of them. I've had to Google them all. Right, I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Did well. I was going to say get my wee leg but it's nearly enough a home leg because Leipzig and Berlin aren't that far apart <laughs> in the grand scheme of things you know if we can hold on to this I shouldn't say this because the microphone picks it up and then all of a sudden they score they're bringing a elite attacking midfielder off for a world class midfielder Let's have a look at the subs, what have we got? Everybody's doing okay. Cancel, right, Sato. Shrek with a save. Oh, for a crowd of them out, well done. Anything else? Don't have much options on the bench, to be honest. Yeah, well, if you'd gave me enough time, assistant manager, I would have told him to ease off the tackles. <coughs> I'd like to have another look to see what I've got on the bench. Right, Lawrence. You see, I've got a lot of wingers and I'm not playing that tactic at the moment. Anybody really struggling? Slotner's probably struggling. We'll take him off for, for Perry. And that is... The only change we're going to make at the moment. Right, this is... Oh, we're going a bit more attacking. There's Huberic. And that's a poor free kick. Don't want to concede this late. 
give us a mountain to Lawrence, to Gonzalez, to Lawrence, Yamez, who's had a fairly good game, gets tackled, Chipper, Pereira, Chipper, Sato, Morel Jr, and that's a goal. That. that wasn't good. We couldn't go any defensive or because we're already as defensive as we can. Two one away from home. It's, could be worse. Could be better. <laughs> uh, team talk. I'm gonna go aggressive. I think. Far from pleased. There we go. Who's the motivated? Jeremy Wood, you're an empty. Right, so I'll skip past the hamburger game because we'll get beat in that one and we'll come back for the Leipzig game. And there we go. Oh, and just so you know, Ertugul Salam, he's going to be labelled the next Ertugul Salgam. Me neither. Right, we're back for RB Leipzig game and we're going to go all out attacking because we need to get a goal back. This is a good side. I can see us going out here. But we're just going to go for it. We beat Hamburg 1-0. Simic with a goal. So we're going for Shrek, Lejeune, Wood, Boy and Colombo. And then Bompart, Lawrence and Alter. Middendorf, Ferreira. And Simic up top. And we're just going to go for it. Oh, we want Amrell on the bench. Have we got Amrell on the bench? I'm sure I put Amrell on the bench. Yeah, he's on the bench, because how cool would that be if we're just to see Amrell run onto a pitch on a winning semi-final? <laughs> yeah, it's a pipe dream. These guys are going to destroy us, but, you know, they've got players that are worth... I, I should have showed you that, but... <laughs> um, right, go on. Get revenge. Kill. I'm not shaking his hand, I don't want to see it. Bomb part. Now, we played a day before, eh, after them, so we're a little bit more tired than them. Colombo wins the ball, but straight to Gonzalez. Chipper. Conte. Oh. This is a frightening attack. Oh. Not sure how to go about winning this. <laughs> I don't think there's anything I can do. This team are so much better. They are below us in the league. And they will finish below us in the league. But they are in a false position. So they'll see this as their only chance of qualifying for Europe. We have two more chances of qualifying for Europe. We could finish in the league positions. And we've got the German Pokal final. So... Yes. Who'd have thought... I thought last year was the, the year that we were going to, we'd overachieved, this year we've really overachieved, with a tiny little squad it's been really hard to balance it, Middendorp gets a second bite with Cherry Ferreira and he shows why he shouldn't be on the bench, Matthias Ferreira, the Frenchman, he's like look at that boss, <laughs> Ricochets all over the place, Ferreira. Bang. Now, do we go defensive? It's kind of early. Let's keep doing what we're doing. Ferreira. Oh, he's lost it. Vargas. Walter. I don't know why I should ask that question, because as soon as I ask that question, oh, and that's a miss. He's going to kick himself with that one. Yeah, as soon as I ask that question, you know we're going to attack. Just keep going. Doing well. Whoa, right. Half time. What do we say? Right, go for it. Do we 
go defensive now. It's a good side. We'd just be inviting pressure, wouldn't we? Oh, Sato. Oof, and from distance. I think we can get creative. A reasonable shout. Pereira, world class midfielder for a wonder kid. Ridiculous. Ridiculous riches. Colombo to actually to a player. That's well done. Althar. Bompart. Middendorp. Warns. Simic. Don't lose it. Middendorp, don't lose it. Over the top. I thought it was going to be a player, but it looks like it'll be a counter though, doesn't it? Lawrence, boom! This is scary. Lejeune with a free kick. I thought it was going long. Out her. Middendorp. Out her kind of scares me a little bit because he's not as good as the other midfielders. Lawrence, Ferreira, and he loses it. <gasps> Simic! Yes! Defend, defend, defend! Tactics, everybody back, everybody back. Um, Ferreira, you're gonna have to come off, mate. Sorry. And music for Middendorp, Hubrick for Ferreira. That looks like an odd combination there. Wait a minute. Right there, right. And then there. Getting too excited here. What is going on? Why? Why have these players all over the place? <laughs> Why are they not sitting right? <laughs> ah, there we go. Sometimes it's really hard to get them in the right positions, eh? Right, and that looks like a fairly Strong line up, let's go for it. And I can't watch for the next <laughs> 25 minutes. Ferreira loses it. And then Simic, bang. <laughs> Brilliant. I am really nervous now. We're inviting pressure on. Can't watch. <laughs> yeah, sorry guys, I can't watch. Right. Quickly. Let's waste some time. Whoa, who's coming off? Right, Lawrence is dying out there. For the Perry. Right, let's go for it. Oh, no, 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 no. Out her. Huberick. One part. Simic. Oh, this is going to be a chance here. Colombo makes a mistake. Hopefully that's a chance. Simic away. Mandrero gets a chance. Boy, Sato. To Walter. Chipper. Conte. Sato. Oh! We're going through to the final! Oh Shrek, take your time. Take your time mate. And that is it, we're in the Europa League final. <coughs> Are we playing Milan? We're not getting Celtic. But it doesn't matter. <sighs> you talk, it was really special. I don't know how good Milan are. I do not know how good Milan are. 
I am so nervous there. It's a pity we didn't get Celtic, but yeah, these things happen. Um, get Milan. And it's in Cardiff. Graft. And Colombo. We play Milan in the final. And on that note, I am off. And I will see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.